Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Fine, thanks. How are you doing? Fine, fine. Excellent. Nice, nice. I'm I'm fine. <laughs> Yesterday I was in the hospital all all day, but yeah. I I have to say I'm fine. Okay, have to say I'm fine. I'll be better. Okay. Is correct? Uh, yeah. More or less. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, more or less is with numbers. You say more or less. Uh, how many points did she get? Mm, three or four, more or less. Uh -huh. Three or four, more or less, means more points, five, less points or fewer points, or, uh, two. Okay. Two. Mm -hmm. So that is with numbers, you say more or less. With uh, health, for example, how are you? And you want to say, you say so, so, uh -huh. not so good, not so good, so, so. Just fine, just fine. Uh -huh. So, so it's equivalent. Uh, so, uh, more or less. Uh, in Spanish, yes. In English, no. Um, uh, in English, no. Of course. Okay. How are you feeling? Okay. So, so. Okay. So, so is similar to come see, come sir. Okay, come see, come sir. Okay. Okay. Yes. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Okay. So, <laughs> so people, people, people are getting ready. Okay. So let's begin, my dear. Let's begin. Let's see. Okay. Um. Buenas noches. Este es el programa nacional de inglés para el trabajo, modalidad online, beginner three. Welcome to your English class. Today is Monday, September the 26th. This is class 14, good etiquette at work. Good etiquette at work. This is the general, general objective. This is the specific objective. Students will be able to provide oral and written instructions on etiquette at the workplace. And this is the class objective. Students will be able to provide oral and written instructions and guidelines about etiquette in the workplace. Principally, maybe not instructions, but guidelines about etiquette in the workplace. All right. In the agenda tonight, we have good and bad habits, etiquette, reading about etiquette at work, writing a list of rules, okay, um, regarding expected behavior, at work. When we say expected behavior is, the meaning is the way people expect other people to behave, right? So that would be expected behavior. And then we finish with COVID. Ay, how nice if we could finish with COVID, right? We could all go back to work without the mask and, okay. Don't work without worrying about the, the alcohol gel and all of those things. 
okay, well, but the protocol, the protocol still continues. Uh, COVID is still among us, okay? So this is what we're going to be discussing. Okay, you see? Okay. Now let's go to the attendance. Uh, Abigail Mendoza, Mejia Mendoza. Ana Maria Portillo. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice, Ana Maria. Okay. Andrea Amalia Garcia. Andrea Maria Cruz Cruz. Dilcia Yamile Fernández. Emma Gloria. Eh, Amaya. Martínez Amaya, Emma Gloria, Esmeralda del Carmen Amaya, no, Ayala, Esmeralda del Carmen, Gabriela Beatriz Moreno, Jorge Antonio Sánchez, Present teacher. Nice, very good. José Ezequiel Guzmán, Juan José Herrera, Present teacher. Nice, very good. Kenya Elizabeth Rodriguez. Lady Xiomara Chicas. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Maritza Yanir Hernandez. Present teacher. Excellent, very good, nice. Paola Stephanie Mejia. Raquel Abigail Garcia. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Raquel Beatriz Segura. Okay, excellent. See your hand, Raquel. Okay. Okay, pa Paola is still here. Okay. My dear niñitas, please buy microphone. Okay, buy microphone. They are not expensive. Rebeca Guadalupe, Guadalupe Aguillón. Present. Excellent, nice. Sandra Patricia Ramos. No. Stephanie Michelle Oviedo. Present teacher. Excellent, good, very good. Guadalupe del Carmen Silva, we don't know that lady. So from now we're going to put the zero because she doesn't come. Mauricio Antonio Velázquez. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Jonathan Alexis Alfaro. No, not yet. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's go to the groups. Let's begin from the beginning. Good and bad habits. Look at the pictures. Look at the pictures. The first picture. Do you think that is a good or a bad habit? Bad habit. Why is it a bad habit? Eating is necessary because. and eating is good. Because comida chatarra, como se It's, uh -huh, it's junk food. Junk food. Junk food. Yes. Look at the fat. <laughs> this is incredibly, incredibly fat. <laughs> very fat and remember that we we are what we eat so i don't know people say that it's delicious yeah but really fatty it's really fatty so okay what about these ladies good or bad habit Bad habit. Yeah. Because uh, two people deberían de estar comunicándose. Should be talking, right? They should yeah. be talking. Uh huh. Yes. 
these ladies are from Indonesia. And you see here, they are, they are Muslim. Muslim, mm -hmm. Muslims, right? Mm -hmm. They are Muslim. And they are talking, no, they are not talking. They are only using their phones. Okay. Why? I don't know. Maybe it's the mom and the daughter. Mom and daughter, or maybe they are sisters, who knows? Okay. So bad habit. To use the yeah. phone. Should, should be real the Quran. Hey, it should be real the Quran. <laughs> <laughs> No, that's not all the things that they do. <laughs> they do, they, they do normal things too. So, but it's not bad to use the phone. The problem is that they should be talking. Yeah. About the immortality of the crab, but they should be talking. Okay. What about this bad or good habit? It's bad, bad, bad. very bad. Very bad habit. It destroys your lungs, right? Not only your lungs, but the neighbors too. Okay, because they are involuntary smokers. Yeah. They are smoking without filter. So the damage is worse. The damage to the lady's health is terrible. But she has a filter. And the other people, they don't have a filter. Yeah. So it's, it's a terrible problem. The only thing is that the smoke that comes here smoke. goes into her. So that's terrible. I mean, I don't. That is something that people shouldn't do because it's really bad for them. Okay. Then they get cancer, throat cancer, lung cancer, stomach cancer, and many other things. And if the ladies are pregnant, the babies are born with, I mean, with deformations, right? So that's why not. Okay, let's see. In our lives, what are good habits or good practices that we must have? Number one, do exercise. Do exercise, yes, please do exercise. Okay, so I'm going to change color because the red one doesn't, doesn't do what we want. Okay, white. white. This size is good with you? Yeah. No? Yes, okay, okay. So, do exercise. What else? Eat, drink, drink enough tea. water. Okay, excellent. Eat healthy and drink enough water. Drinking of water. What else? Wash hands before eating. Yes, exactly. Wash your hands before eating. Wash your hands before eating. Excellent. What else? Have a bath every day. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. What else? Sure. Wash okay. your teeth after okay. eating. Yes, brush your teeth. Brush your teeth. Okay. After eating. Yeah. What else? Sleep at least eight hours. Sleep. Okay. At least eight hours a night. Okay. What else? 
to do exercise. Do exercise. Do exercise. It's the first one, right? Mm, okay. But you can say, go for a walk. Go for a walk. Or run. Or run. Go for a walk or a run in the park. What else? Don't be late for work. Okay, so the opposite, be on time. Be on time for work. Be on time. Be on time for work. For what work. else? Mm -hmm. Tell the truth. Uh -huh. What else? Be sincere. It's a good habit. Be respectfully. Be respectful. Be respectful, be sincere, tell the truth, be on time for work, go for a walk or, or run in the park, sleep at least eight hours a night, brush your teeth after eating, take a shower every day, Wash your hands before eating, drink enough water, eat healthy, do exercise. What else? Greet to others. Yeah, greet others. Greet others. Mm -hmm. Read else? books. Read books. Uh -huh. What else? Learn some musical instrument. Learn how to play a musical instrument. Okay, excellent. What else? Be patient. Be patient. Be patient. Sometimes it's difficult. Be patient. Change clothes every day, particularly underwear. So change clothes every day. Take a shower every day. Yeah, take a shower and change clothes. Don't put on the same socks because they're going to be standing like that and walk. So Change clothes every day. What else? Relax, relax, exercise. Okay. Practice. Yoga. <laughs> Relaxation. Yeah, yoga, why not? Relaxation. Yeah, from yoga, the physical exercise, not the philosophy. Stay away from the philosophy, it's really dangerous. But, but the exercise of yoga is good for the body. Okay, so the physical exercise, not the mental practice. Okay, so what else? Practice relaxation, change clothes every day, meditate. and uh, create action plans. Okay, meditate and create action plans. What's that teacher? Means meditate is not mm, no, 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 it's not that. That's not the meditation. So think. Okay, what things did I do today? Uh, today, I did this, 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 and this. Okay, which of these activities is beneficial? Which of these activities should I do more often? Okay, which of these activities are destructive and I should stop doing? Okay, and then you create the plan action. 
I'm doing this and it's not right. Next time, I'm going to substitute it for something different like this, okay? Like for example, I'm uh, chewing gum. I'm chewing gum too much. It causes cavities and uh, it's bad for the stomach. Later I can get, uh, because the, the intestinal gases are out because of the exercise of your mouth, they think that you are eating. So the gases are poor and then that creates gastritis. So uh, they tell you that it's good for relaxation. Uh, look for other things for relaxation, okay? Because it is bad for your stomach. So then uh, chewing gum is considered to be detrimental to health because of gastritis. So in this case, what can you do? Or if you chew gum, it's okay, chew gum. But uh, eat something later or and brush your teeth eliminate the sugar from the teeth. Okay, so what else? What else can be considered a good habit? Be Say, faithful. Be faithful, yes. Be faithful. You think that nobody's watching you, but <laughs> believe me, not only God is watching you, but somehow there are neighbors, they are friends or friends, friends of friends and friends of friends who are watching. And then they go, hey, you know, I saw your husband with another woman in this and this place. And what? That's impossible. He's very faithful. And then they discover that it's possible. Okay, so no, it's better to be faithful. Okay, so. Let's see. So these are some of the things that are considered good habits. Okay. Do exercise, eat healthy, drink enough water, wash your hands before eating, take a shower every day, brush your teeth after eating, sleep at least eight hours a night, go for a walk or run in the park, be on time for work, tell the truth, be sincere, be respectful, greet others, read notes, learn how to play a musical instrument, be patient, change clothes every day, practice relaxation, meditate and uh, create action plans, be faithful, okay. So, okay. One last thing that I would add is uh, don't take only mental notes. Put the notes into paper or in, in the computer if you want. But keep a backup of the computer. Because if the computer crashes, you lose everything. Okay, another thing is finish everything before you go to bed so you can sleep. If, if you don't finish, you go to bed and you're thinking, oh, I'm missing this, I'm missing maybe not consciously, but unconsciously, and that doesn't let you rest. So that is really terrible, okay? If you don't finish everything and then you're thinking, oh, in tomorrow, what am I going to do, right? So good habits, bad habits. What are bad habits? To lie. Okay, lying. Lying is a bad habit. What else? Smoking. And of course, drinking. Still. Sorry, my friend. Still. Robar. Uh, yeah. Only that that is not only a bad habit, but a crime. Uh -huh. Be lazy. Yeah. Okay. Stealing. Okay. Being, being lazy. Being lazy is another bad habit. What else? Do not greet. Sorry? Do not greet. Ah, no yeah. Uh -huh, exactly. We're going to put here being a... proud 
or being, yeah. Yeah, let's you can say like being proud. Proud, no, proud. Being proud, okay, being hoisty. No? Sometimes we think that we are better than others. That is a big mistake, okay? Thinking that we are better. Okay, what else? Sedentary lifestyle. Yeah. Sedentarism. Sedentarism. Yeah. Be angry. Uh -huh, being angry, right? Oh, let me see. Sorry, that it, it was written in a different place. Okay. Being angry. What else? Miss War without excuse yes that's true missing work for no reason uh -huh. missing missing work for no reason okay so that has... Be a liar. sorry minita repeat Be a liar. mentiroso ah. o ser mentiroso lying no digo uh -huh. nada like the first one, uh -huh. I thought you say being Malia. Yes, being Malia too. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the teacher is Malia. So, okay, now you say, yeah, mea culpa, mea culpa, right? So, being, <laughs> being Malia, okay, so being mean. What else? Complain for all. Yeah, complain about everything. Complain about everything, yes. What else? Complain about everything. Be dirty. Okay. Be dirty. Complain about everything. Being mean. Missing work for no reason. Being angry. Sedentarism. Thinking about we. Thinking that we are better than others. Being proud. Being lazy. Eat. Stealing. Drinking. Smoking. Lying. What else? Eat fast food every day. Okay. Eating fast food every day. The problem is not occasional. The problem is every day. So eating fast food every day, getting up late. And going to bed late. I'm guilty. Going to bed after midnight. Yes, I'm guilty. Getting up late? No. But going to bed after midnight. What else? Driving a high speed. Yes. Driving at high speed. Driving very fast. Okay. What else? Don't pay attention when someone is talk with you. Yes, ignoring people, right? Ignoring people when they are talking to you. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. What else? Be bad with animals. Yeah. Be mean to animals. Be mean to animals. Okay, we should protect animals and plants. First, the category goes like this. First, people. After people, animals, then plants and so forth. Plants, what is mean? plants feel, sorry? What is mean? Mean, malo, okay? Grotero, okay. pésimo. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Pésimo no en el sentido correcto de la palabra, que significa malísimo, paupérrimo. No, pésimo en el sentido como lo usamos en El Salvador. So, mean, be mean to animals. What else? What else can be like? Okay, not drinking, or well, let's put like this. Replacing water. with uh, uh, soda or other PC drinks. Okay, replacing water with soda or other PC drinks. Like someone says, I, I don't like to drink water. I'm going to drink soda. Okay, or I, I don't like water. I'm going to drink uh, refreshment. Okay. Yeah, you can drink refreshment, but water is on its own right. Yeah. So, lying, smoking, drinking, stealing, being lazy, being proud. Okay. Okay. Uh, drinking, thinking that we are better than others, sedentarism, being angry. Missing work for no reason, being mean, complain about everything, be dirty, eating fast food every day, getting up late, going to bed after midnight, driving at high speeds, ignoring people when they are talking to you, uh, being mean to animals and replacing water with soda or fizzy drinks. But not only that, also being intolerant. Being intolerant and violent. Being intolerant and violent. When I say being intolerant and violent, I'm not saying accept, accept every crazy idea as correct, but no. People are people and they should be respected because they are people. If they believe that they are oranges, it's okay, but you, you know that they are people and you continue to treat them with respect. If they think that they are carrots, okay, or bananas or oranges, whatever, you know that that's not true. You know that they are people. So you respect them, okay? treat them, okay, with delicacy. Yes, you don't like what they do, but should you attack them? No. Do you, do you have to embrace what they do? No. Accept? No. But tolerate? Yes. Means don't attack them. Don't be violent. Okay. So that is like that. Okay. And another probable bad habit is calling calling names. Calling people names okay calling people names teacher what is calling people names ideas like okay and in high school i remember that we had a friend we called him maldorin and there was another one that was a uh, mika cholka was in mico serio right so they were boyfriend and girl. 
<laughs> okay, so those are what? Names. So Amen. calling people names. That is, uy, in Chalatenango, that is a really bad habit. Okay. It's a really bad habit. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it's something that we should avoid. Yeah, people have special characteristics, but we shouldn't uh, compare them to anything. Okay. Respect them, respect them, call them the name. Don't call them. Okay. The Lord has told me to come here. Now, right. So, no, no, no. Okay, sis, that's not good. Okay. So, that is calling people names. It's a bad habit, too. Okay. Being late. We said being late, right? Being late to appointments. Being late. To everything. Being late to everything is a bad habit. Okay. Finding excuses. Finding excuses is another bad habit. Ah, oh, no, but me because. I was born poor and, you know, me, pulsito, right? So, excuse me, okay? Finding excuses. All right, excellent. So, these are good habits and these are bad habits. Okay, teacher, can you send us? Yes, after class, I'm going to send you the, uh, this again, okay? I'm going to send it to you again for you to have the, now, my friends, we're going to practice this dialogue. Okay. And we're going to decide if what the boys, what one boy is doing is a good or a bad habit. Okay. Let's say in this family, there are only three people, Tony, Jack, and uh, Tony, Jack, and the mother only. There is no father to speak of. Okay, it's just the three of them. Okay, like many families nowadays, okay. So we have, we men have to be responsible, okay. Our family is so beautiful, we shouldn't abandon it, okay. So check out here, it says, practice this dialogue. Jack, stop slacking around and help me with this. What's so important, Tony? What are you doing? I'm cooking for our mom and us. Now that she has the COVID, she can't get off of bed. We must help her with the house chores. Please do the dishes while I cook, okay? Okay, I will, but first, I want to watch some videos on my phone. It's late, let's start now. But if you don't care about our mom, I will do the dishes. Yet, don't pretend you care about her, okay? Uh, but I will only do the dishes. Okay, fine. I will cook, set the table, and serve. I think I can set the table too. Smart thinking. I will appreciate that. Okay, again. Jack, stop slacking around and help me with this. Teacher, what is slacking around? Flojeando, <laughs> okay, flojeando means arganeando, right? So other people use other terms, okay? But other people use other words more colorful, but we're going to say arganeando or flojeando, okay? So olgazaneando. Olgazaneando, exactly. Jack, stop slacking around and help me with this. What's so important, Tony? What are you doing? I'm cooking for our mom and us. Now, now that she has the COVID, she can't get off of bed. We must help her with the house chores. Please do the dishes while I cook, okay? Okay, I will. But first, I want to watch some videos on my phone. It's late, let's start now. But if you don't care about our mom, I will do the dishes. 
yet don't pretend you care about her, okay? But I will, but I will only do the dishes. Okay, fine. I will cook, set the table and serve. I think I can set the table too. Smart thinking, I will appreciate that. Appreciate that, okay? Appreciate that. Slacking around. Help me with this. So important, what's so important? What are you doing? I'm cooking for our mom and us. Use no, us, us. Cooking for our mom and us. Now that she has the COVID, she can't get off of bed. We must help her with the house chores. Please do the dishes while I cook, okay? Okay, I will. But first, I will watch some videos on my phone. It's late, let's start now. But if you don't care about our mom, I will do the dishes. Yep, don't pretend you care about her, okay? But I will only do the dishes. Okay, fine. I will cook, set the table and serve. I think I can set the table too. Smart thinking. I will appreciate that. Appreciate that. Okay, let's practice the conversation in the groups. Okay. Let's see. First, let's see how many people we are. We're 21, so in reality, we're 20. Okay. I'm going to make five groups. Groups are opening. Please join. Okay, we have Andrea Maria Cruz, Paola Estefania Mejia, Raquel Segura, Andrea Patricia Ramos. Around and help me, and help me with this. What? So important, Tony. What are you doing? I'm cooking for our mom and us now that she has the COVID. She can get off of bed. We must help her with the house chores. Please do the, do the dishes while I cook, okay? Okay, I will, but first I want to watch some videos on my phone. It's late, it, it's late. Let's start now. But if you don't care about our mom, I will do the dishes. Yet, don't pretend you care about her, okay? But I will only do the dishes. Okay, fine. I will cook, set the table, and serve. I think I can set the table too. Smarting thinking. I will appreciate that. Okay. No sé si lo invertimos para que después siga otra pareja. Okay. Good. Excelente. Dele, dele, Jonathan. Y yo soy la siguiente. Ok. Jack, stop slacking around and help me with this. What's so important, Tony? What are you doing? I'm cooking for our mom and, food and us. Now that she has the COVID, she can get off of bed. We must help her with the house chores. Please do the dishes while I cook, okay? Okay, I'll, I will, 
but first I want to watch some videos on my phone. It's late. Let's start now. But if you don't care about our mom, I will do the dishes get done. Pretend you care about here, okay. But I will only do the dishes. Okay, fine. I will cook, set the table and serve. I think I can serve the table too. A smart thinking, I will appreciate that. Excellent. The next, vamos a ver. Andrea. Ahorita. Va, empiezo mm. yo. Ok. Jack, estoy todos laying around and help me with, with this. What's so important, Tony? What are you doing? I'm cooking for our mom and us now that she has the COVID, she can get out of bed. We must help her with the house chores. Please do the dish, do the dishes while I cook, okay? Okay, I will, but first I want to watch some videos on my phone. It's late. Let's start now. But if you don't care about our mom, I will do the dishes. Just don't appreciate you care about her. Okay. But I will only do the dishes. Okay, fine. I will cook, set the table, and serve. A smart thinking. I will appreciate that. No, la anterior okay. es la otra. Perdón. Uh, I think I can set the table too. Smart thinking. I will appreciate, appreciate it that. Es mi impresión. Oh, yo siento bien trabado este diálogo. A mí me costó un poco. Sí, está bien difícil. Tiene bastantes como, no sé, test. Ok. Eh, eh, oh. This. What's so important, Tony? What are you doing? I'm cooking for our mom and us. Now that she has the COVID, she can get off the bed. We must help her with the house chores. Please do the dishes while I cook. Okay. Okay, I will. But first, first I want to watch some videos on my phone. It's late. Let's start now. But if you don't care about our mom, I will do the dishes. Just don't pretend you care about her. Okay. But I will only do the dishes. Okay, fine. I will cook, set the table, and serve. I think I can set the table too. Smart thinking. I will appreciate that. Okay, entonces, <laughs> si quieren con Raquel, ahora. Can wipe the house source. Please do the dish while I I cook, okay? Okay, I will. But first, I want to watch some videos on my phone. It's late. Let's start now. But if you don't care about or more, I will do the dishes. She don't threaten you care about her, okay? But I... We'll only the, do the dishes. Okay, fine. I will call. We will we'll set the table and serve. I think I can set the table too. 
smart thing. I will appreciate that. Ok, ahora sería con Dicia. Si gusta, comience usted, Dicia, por favor. But, but we we'll only to do the dishes. Ok, fine. I will cook, set the table and serve. I think I can set the table too. Smart thinking, I will appreciate that. Ahora cambio. Ok. Ok, voy a silenciar el mío. Bueno. Ok. ¿Va a ser Tony? Hello. Hello, hello. Marixa. Kenya. Hola. Eh, yeah, contigo va a ser el diálogo. Ah, conmigo otra vez. Sí. Pensé que con Marixa, lo siento. <risa> Vaya, este. Empiezo okay. yo. Sí, te... comienzas. Jack. Stop slacking and running. Help me with this. What's so important, Tony? What are you doing? Looking for her mom and us. Now that she has the COVID, she can get off of bed. We must help her with the house chores. Please do the dishes while I cook, okay? Okay, I will. But first, I want to watch some video on my phone. It's late. Let's start now. But if you don't care about our mom, I will do the dishes. Yeah, don't pretend you care about her, okay? But I will only, only do the dishes. Terminaste? Sí, en ser. Okay. I think I can set the to uh, the table too. Smart thinking. I will appreciate that. Okay. A ver si um, alcanzamos con otro diálogo. Y Marixa. Ah, sí. Okay, seems like the other people don't come out. So we are only 17 right now. Check out here, pronunciation. Capri, she ate. Appreciate. I'm going to separate it. Okay. I'll put it on top. It's more visible. Appreciate. 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 I will appreciate that. I will appreciate. Okay, excellent. Now everybody's out, let's move on. Okay, etiquette. The purpose is to discuss etiquette. Okay, 
here are some questions that we need to discuss. Okay. First, define etiquette. Number two, where is it necessary to observe etiquette? In what places is it necessary to observe etiquette? In what areas of life is it necessary to observe etiquette? For example, when I say, teacher, if we go to the bank, there is a line. What do we have to do? Stand in line. Look for the last person. Not say, ah, I don't care. I'm late. And you go directly to the cashier or to the bank teller. Excuse me. Can you help me, please? Please go to the line. No, no, I only have a question. No, go to the line. So that is etiquette, okay? So where is necessary to observe etiquette? How do we feel about people who don't follow etiquette? Do people always know what they are expected to do? Why not? Is etiquette important in society? Okay, these are the questions, but first, attendance. Let's go to attendance and then we discuss. Abigail Maria Mendoza? Mejia, present. Mejia, changing your name, uh -huh. making sure you're present. Okay, present. Ana Maria Portillo? Present teacher. Excellent. Andrea Amalia Garcia. Andrea Maria Cruz Cruz. Present. Excellent. Nice. Dilcia Yamile Fernandez. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Emma Gloria Martinez. Present teacher. Excellent. Emma. Nice. Esmeralda del Carmen Ayala. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Gabriela Beatriz Moreno. Gaby Moreno. Okay. Dice present teacher. Uh -huh. Her microphone maybe is bad. Okay. Okay, Jorge Antonio Sanchez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Jose Ezequiel Guzman. Yes, I am here. Excellent, nice my friend, very good. Juan Jose Herrera. Present teacher. Excellent, very good. Kenya Elizabeth Rodriguez. Present teacher. Yeah, nice, very good. Lady Xiomara Chicas. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Eh, Maritza Yanir Hernández. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Paola Stephanie Mejía. Present teacher. Okay. We have two Mejías, right? And you say, teacher, teacher, we all have two Mejías. No, I mean, we have uh, Abigail Mejía and Stephanie Mejía. And we have Sandra Mejía too. Well, there are many Mejías. Okay? That's good. That's good. Raquel Abigail Garcia. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Raquel Beatriz Segura. Eh, Rebeca Guadalupe Aguillón. Present. Nice, very good. Sandra Patricia Ramos. Okay, Stephanie Michelle Oviedo. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Mauricio Antonio Velázquez. Present teacher. Very good, nice. Jonathan Alexis Alfaro. Present. Excellent, very good. So let's continue. Okay, we're going to discuss these questions. So let's go to the group.
Okay. Raquel, you may join your group. You are in group five. My dear Raquel, you never join the groups. Raquel nunca se une a los grupos. Maybe some quality or characteristic, como se dice característica, teacher? Characteristic. Characteristic. Does yes. someone have? Um, that characteristic or action or habit. Habit. Habit is okay. Good. And uh, other people she... know know him or, or know her for that habit or actions <laughs> or decisions. Education. Yes. For, the, for example, if somebody is, um, como se dice, tardista o impuntual. A, a late comer, late uh, comer or impuntual. Or impuntual, late comer or impuntual. Her or his etiquette is that, I think. <laughs> Okay. What do you think? Even are we uh, talking about the first one? Okay. Or the second one. Okay. What do you think, Emma or Esmeralda? I think um, that are good behavior. Okay. Bueno, the next question. Where is, is it necessary to observe etiquette? Uh, I think it's a uh, event uh, of gala and in formal meetings. Okay. I think in my case, I can when at a diner. Okay. Perfecto. Perfect. So, I think mass, someone. Well. Where is necessary to show it? Where? I don't know. <laughs> For example, when, when we go on the bus mm -hmm. and we say, we see a uh, embarazada pregnant, we mm -hmm. le damos el asiento, no sé cómo se dice. We up. No sé si así sería eso. Give up our seats. Yeah, it's a type of etiquette. Okay. 
Thanks. Thanks, teacher. Ok. Allí. Quiero ver. Bueno, podemos seguir con la siguiente. Vea. Eh, how do you feel about social o algo así? Mm -hmm. um, social, so, social clubs, digamos. Mm -hmm. In the workplace with my co-workers. Um, for example, when we have a meeting with mm, um, sí. the family or neighborhoods. Um, with the friends. With, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. And number three, how do you feel about people who don't follow etiquette? Que sentimos nosotros o oh, uh -huh, sobre la gente que no sigue la etiqueta o que no cumple con las normas de etiqueta. Por ejemplo, cuando hay alguien que es irrespetuoso. Um, people, we don't have the respect with the, the, um, the social group or, or, um, um we he he don't have a, has a respect with the people mm. in my case me alejo um how do you feel how do you feel about people, people who don't who don't follow? I feel sad. ¿Cómo? I feel sad. Nah. Um, when the people is is um, don't when the people don't don't follow the etiquette, mm, the people don't respect the society. For, for example, we don't we. Um, when the when a place uh, we don't have a good habit we can we can be we can be rejected Cuando nosotros no seguimos o no somos educados o no respetamos, podemos ser rechazados. ¿Verdad? Yes. Ok. Question four. Do people always know what they are expected to do? Okay. We do people always No entendió cómo De acuerdo al lugar en el que estamos, esperamos que las personas se comporten de, de diferente forma, vean. Yes. Serían 
the people um, according to you know, we according to the place they know why not they know Ay, no sé cómo responder esa pregunta. Ay, mira. Ajá. Decía como que la gente siempre espera. Eh... que actuemos como, como según ellos, o cómo es la pregunta. Que si las personas... Es que la pregunta es que si usted sabe cómo, qué es lo que usted espera de ellos. Por ejemplo, eh, estamos en, como decía Paola, en una fancy party. Pues nosotros esperamos que, que se comporten Depende al lugar, ¿verdad? Bien, elegante. Uh -huh. O sea, hay que traducir eso en inglés. Uh -huh. I have. Supongo yo. Sí, está. Tumbre. Ajá. Bueno, entonces, esto te dirían como unas reglas ¿verdad? que hay que seguir. Ajá. Uh -huh ante una ante un por ejemplo una, una comida que le ha invitado a uno exactamente entonces se dice que son reglas este are ruler que se que se aplican son reglas que se aplican va uh -huh, apply That... por normas de convivencia algo así también ¿cómo? también como normas de convivencia ajá cabal también Son reglas, normas, reglas este procedimiento algo yeah. Yeah, aplique en a rule that aplique in a certain Okay. Well, my dear ones, everybody's out now. Yes, everybody's out. And we are 22. So, sorry, my dear ones, let's continue. The definition for etiquette. We had it one slide before. Etiquette is a set of conventional rules of personal behavior in polite society, usually in the form of an ethical code that delineates the expected and accepted social behaviors that accord with the conventions and norms observed by a society, a social class or a social group. 
Okay. It's enough to say that it's a set of conventional rules of personal behavior in a polite society. Okay, enough. The rest is blah, 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 blah. <laughs> so this is the definition of etiquette. Okay. Let's see, let's continue my friends. Okay. These are classroom etiquettes, classroom etiquette. When you go to class, be punctual, be respectful, be present for the whole session, don't leave class early, address the professor correctly, teacher address the professor correctly, dirijase al profesor de una forma correcta, they address the professor correctly. And the teacher, y el profesor tiene que dirigirse a usted de la forma correcta también. Es recíproco, recíproco, no solamente usted tiene obligación hacia el maestro, sino el maestro tiene más obligación hacia el padre. Okay, so is both. Turn off your cell phone. Don't answer calls while in class. Don't pack your brief or briefcase or stuff before class ends. Participate in class enthusiastically. Wait for the teacher to finish the class before leaving. Prepare and read ahead of time. Ask questions. Raise your hand before speaking. Stay on task and don't get distracted. Ask Ask before using technology. Don't use your cell phone to play in class. Ask for permission to come in and go out. Say thank you when you when granted permission. Be nice and smile when permission is denied. Don't talk to your partner about, I mean, during explanations. Okay, questions? Okay, I'm going to repeat them. Be punctual, punctual, be punctual, be respectful, be present for the whole session. Don't leave class early. Address the professor correctly. Turn off your cell phone. Don't answer calls while in class. Don't pack your stuff before class ends. Participate in class enthusiastically. Wait for the teacher to finish the class before leaving. Prepare and read ahead of time. Ask questions. Raise your hand before speaking. Stay on task and don't get distracted. Ask before using technology. Don't use your cell phone to play in class. Ask for permission to come in and go out. Okay, to permission to come in and go out. Say thank you when granted permission. Be nice and smile when permission is denied. Don't talk to your partner during explanations. Easy, right? Or questions? Okay. Esmeralda is very tired. You are very tired, right, Esmeralda? Yes. Don't worry. We're going to finish the class in 40 minutes. Teacher, don't help me with 40 minutes, imagine. 40 minutes. So, that's preparation, reading. What should you do when, before we actually begin the reading, what should you do when arriving at work. When you arrive at work, what is the first thing that you should do? Ideas? Great to the other people. Greet. Yeah, greet. Greet. greet, say hello, right? Say good morning. 
Okay. Yes. That is expected to say hello, say good morning. Okay. Uh -huh. When writing emails, what are you expected to do when writing emails? Ideas? Be polite. Be polite. First, uh, have the, the address of the person that you're sending the email to, write a subject to the message, and then in the body, begin with a greeting, the explanation of the email, and then of course the body in a closing. So that is expected. Speaking When speaking on the phone, what is expected? Listen. When the person finishes, speak. Okay. Listen to the person so you answer coherently to what the person is saying. The person says, ah, but what are you going to do tomorrow? And you say, no, because I don't have tortillas. Ah, uh, what? That I don't have tortillas. No, I am. I'm asking you, what are you going to do tomorrow? Uh, my mom doesn't know. What? Okay. So the person cannot hear. So listen so that you may have a good conversation. Okay. When speaking on the phone, be polite, be patient, don't shout. Okay, at the table while eating, what is something that you should do? Eat with the mouth closed. If something is big, don't open the big mouth. No, something is big, chop it in small pieces, and then you eat it. <laughs> okay, so that is etiquette, okay? And uh, the, you are not expected, well, you're expected not to put the elbows on the table, okay? In your house, another story, in your house, no problem. You have permission. But if you go to a dinner, don't put the elbow. Okay. And of course, don't talk about things that are not nice at mealtime. Oh, you know, there was an accident. I saw a man there. He was bleeding and everything was coming out. Hey, come on, we're eating. Don't talk about those things, right? Choose the topics carefully when you speak at the table. Okay. Talk with other people. When talking with other people, what? What do you great, think? Great with a handshake. Ah, greet with a handshake. Greet with a handshake, yes. What else? Be polite. Be polite. Mm -hmm. Smile. Don't, don't loud. Uh, don't laugh at the mm -hmm. person, <laughs> but, but smile, okay, smile, mm -hmm. okay, excellent, very look, <clears throat> look the eyes when you speak. Look at the eyes of the person when you're talking, because sometimes you say, hey, how are you today? Um, I'm fine, you know, and looking at, at the ceiling or okay or on the floor and the person say hey did you lose did you lose something uh no <laughs> okay so look at the person okay look at the person so it's important excellent thank you Rebecca. that's true okay excellent let's continue etiquette at work okay two pages okay two pages 
It says, I'm going to read it and then you practice reading it in the groups. There are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. I'm going to point with a hand, okay? So to your office. If you are late because you had an emergency, 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 that's okay. However, habitual latecomers are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concerned authority and report the reason why you are late. Etiquette is also important when you have to communicate with employees or clients in any part of the world. In those cases, it is necessary to have good knowledge of the workplace email etiquette of other countries. In the official emails, you need to mention the subject clearly and be concise. You also need Precise. all the important details. You should use formal and grammatical correct language for email. In addition, knowledge of the telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. Well, uh, don't use very before essential. Only say is essential. Like you never say muy principal, okay? Solo principal, es principal, no muy principal. Tampoco con esencial, es mejor usar, es essential, it's essential, no very, okay? We have to speak on the telephone at some point during our daily work. Be polite when you talk to other employees or your supervisors. Listen to what they say carefully and do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clear and you speak to avoid wrong interpretations. Or be sure your voice is clear when you speak to avoid wrong interpretations. Etiquette guidelines are important even when you are celebrating with your coworkers. If you get a call when you are eating, say, excuse me, and then receive the call. Do not talk loudly while eating, and remember to close your mouth when you chew. You should remember that your behavior and manners are under observation. Following etiquette guidelines can play a very vital role for future promotion. Okay, please eliminate very. Say, play a vital role for future promotion. Say, chew. Uh -huh. Okay, not very vital and not very essential. That's too okay. okay. So, only that. Okay, my friends. Esto es del, del nuestro libro de texto, ¿verdad? Solo lo copié y lo pegué aquí. Okay. Pero sí, esa cosa está perfecta. Solo que estas dos cositas no deben ser. No se dice muy principal, solo principal. No se dice más después. Sí, ¿verdad? Más después, sí. Más antes no se dice. Ok, o... Bueno, ustedes sabrán lo que dice. Pero that is something that we should learn in, in our grammar. Ok, so, this is the reading. Do you have any questions? Questions about the reading? <clears throat> For the moment, no. Okay. Before we go to practice the reading, let's answer these questions. If you know you are late, you should what? Compensate the time 
call the person you report to, not do anything about it. Let it be. Mm -hmm. Let it be, right? Yes. B. Okay. What's a tip to apply in official email? Send the email in English. Use a long salutation. Express the subject clearly. Letter C. C. Exactly. Letter C. Very good. Now let's go to the read. Okay. The groups are opening. Según entendí, ¿verdad? Así es, es correcto. Ok. ¿Quién empieza? Uh... Si sí, gusto yo. Eso, okay. así es. Así es. <risa> There are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office if you are late because you had an emergency. That is okay. However, habitual late commerce are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on, on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. Organization, if you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concert authority and report the reason why you are late. Etiquette it's also important when you have to communicate with employees or clients in any part of the world. In those cases, it is necessary to have good knowledge of the workplace email etiquette of other countries. <laughs> In the official email, you need to mention it to solve it clearly and be concise. You also need to include all the important details. You should use formal and grammatically correct language for email. In addition, knowledge of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the telephone at some point during our daily work. Be polite when you talk to your employees or your supervisor. <clears throat> Listen to what they say carefully and do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clearly when you speak to avoid wrong interpretation. Etiquette guidelines are important even when you are celebrating with your co workers. If use formal, grammatically correct language for email. In addition, knowledge of, of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the telephone at some point during our daily work. Uh, be be polite when you talk to your employees or your supervisors. 
Listen to what they say carefully and do not interrupt. Um, somos cuatro y había otra persona. Este yo también. <laughs> Vaya, ahora voy yo. ¿Hasta dónde iba a llegar? Si quieres, hasta donde dice receive the call. Uh -huh, está ahí. Be sure your voice is clean when you speak to avoid wrong interpretation. Etiquette giderlins are important ever when you are celebrating with you co-workers. Y faltaba. If you get a call when you are eating, say excuse me in the in the receiver the call. Do not talk slowly while eating and remember to close your mouth when you chew. You should remember that your behavior and manners are under us. 18. And remember to close your mouth when you say you should remember that your behavior, behavior and managers are under observation for etiquette when the line, no sé si se dice, can play a very vital role for future promotion. Guidelines. Guidelines. Mm -hmm. Guidelines. 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 Con K. Guidelines. Oh. Guidelines. No, ga, ga. Guidelines. 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 Ok. La siguiente que va a leer. Gracias, teacher. My pleasure, niñita. My pleasure. Paola, ¿está por ahí? Okay. Si está lee ahora usted. In the official emails, you need to mention the subject clearly and be concise. You also need to include all the important details. You should use formal and grammatically correct language for emails. In addition, I know no like of telephone etiquette in the work in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the telephone at some point during our daily work. Be polite when you talk to your employees or your supervisor. Listen to what they say carefully and don't, bueno, do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clear when you speak to avoid wrong interpretation. Etiquette, guilt, guiltless are important Every, every when you are celebrate, celebrating with your co-worker. If you get a call when you are 80, say excuse. Grammatically correct language for emails. In addition, I no veo, perdón, es que se me han arruinado los lentes. Ahí voy, espérenme. Knowledge of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very es essential. 
we have to speak on the telephone at some point during our daily work. Be polite, polite as teacher, polite. 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 When you talk to your employees or your supervisors, listen to what they say careful and do you need interrupt in the cap teacher interrupt 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 be sure your voice is clear when you speak to avoid wrong interpret interpretation 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 etiquette Como me dijo que se pronunciaba ese? Guidelines. 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 Are important even when you are celebrating. Even. With, even. Ay, es que no veo. Even. Even. When you are celebrating with. When you are celebrating with your. Co-workers. Co if you get a call when you are eating, say, excuse me. And then receive the call. Do not talk. Ese no sé cómo se pronuncia. Loudly. Loudly. Loudly while eating. And remember to close your mouth when you check. When you chew. chew. Ah, when you chew. You, you should remember that your... Ese no sé cómo se pronuncia. Behavior. Behavior. And... Behavior. Manners, manners, manners. Behavior, behavior and manners. Behavior and manners. Uh -huh. Are under observation following, following a ticket. Guidance can play a very... Vital. A very, no era, verdad? Yeah, play vital. a... Be, vital. <laughs> for vital. future promotions. Vital role. Vital role. Mm -hmm. vital, promotion. vital, vital role for... Vital, vital role. By the rules. By the rules. Okay. By the rules. Okay. Tal vez nos queda chance de leerlo. Oh, no. There are 16 people out. We're missing others. Okay, now we're 21, let's continue. Okay, before we do this one, we're going to do this one. Okay. Practice this dialogue. Hey, Jen, have you prepared the protocol list for workers yet? What do you mean? Don't you remember that we are going to visit a company tomorrow? Oh, that, I don't really know what to list. You must, you must greet, greet be, and be polite. You must keep your face masks on all the time, etc. Thanks, now I have a better idea. I'll start working on that now. Great, please show it to me when you're done with it. Okay, sure, no problem. Okay. Again, hey Jen, have you prepared the protocol list for workers yet? What do you mean? Don't you remember that we're going to visit a company tomorrow? Oh, that, 
I don't really know what to list. You must greet and be polite. You must keep your face masks on, on all the time, etc. Thanks. Now I have a better idea. I'll start working on that now. Great. Please show it to me when you are done with it. Okay? Sure. No problem. Okay? You will practice the conversation. Practice the conversation. <laughs> okay, boy. Hey, Jen, have you prepared the protocol list for workers yet? What do you mean? Don't you remember that we are going to visit a company tomorrow? Ah, that I don't really know what to list. You must greet. You must greet. And be polite. You must keep your face mask on all time. It's it. I don't know. Remember how to say that. Etc. Etc. Et okay. Uh, thank you. Thanks. No, I have a better idea. I will start working on that. No. Great. Please show it to me when. <laughs> hey Jen, how you prepare to the protocol list for worker jet? What do you mean? Don't you remember that we are going to visit a company tomorrow? Ah, that I don't really know what to list. You must greet and be, be polite. You must keep your face mask on all the time, etc. Thanks. Now I have a better idea. I'll start working on that now. Great. Please show it to me, it to me when you are done with, with it, okay? Sure, no problem. Excellent. Bueno, ahora... Cambiamos, quiero ver, con Jonathan. ¿Cuál fue usted la otra vez, Jonathan? What do you mean? Uh, don't you remember that we are going to visit a company tomorrow? Ah, uh, that's, I don't really know what to list. You must greet and be polite. You must keep your face mask on all the time, etc. Thanks. No, I have a very, very, better, very, better, better. Idea. Idea. idea, 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 idea. I uh, start working on that snow. Great. Please show it to me when you are done. Okay. Uh, sure, no problem. Uy, está bravo el perrito. <laughs> the protocol list for workers yet? What do you mean? Don't you remember that we are going to visit a company tomorrow? Ah, that I don't really know what to lead. You must great and be polite. You must keep your face mask on all the time, etc. 
Thanks. No, I have a bit idea. I start working on that now. Great. Please show it to me when you are done with, with it, okay? Sure, no problem. <coughs> hey, Jane, have you prepared the protocol list for workers yet? What do you mean? Don't you remember that we are going to visit a company tomorrow? Ah, Dad, I don't really know what to list. You must greet. Don't you remember? Don't you remember we are going to visit company tomorrow? Ah, Dad, I don't really know what to list. You must, you must greet and be polite. You must keep your face mask on all the time, etc. Thanks. Now I have a better idea. I'll start working on that now. Ray, please show it to me when you are done Why? with it, okay? Sure, no problem. Okay. ¿Con quién ahora tú con, con Kenya? Empiezas tú o yo, Marixa. Conmigo va a ir de nuevo. Sí. Okay. Empieza si eh, quieres. Empieza usted. Más práctico. Más práctico. Bien. How do you prepare the protocol list for workers yet? ¿Qué? Okay. What do you mean? Don't you remember that we are going to visit a company tomorrow? Oh, that I don't really know what to list. You must greet and be polite. You must keep your face mask on all the time, etc. Thanks. No, I have a better idea. Oh, uh, you start working on that now. Great. Please shoot it to me when you are done with it. Okay. Sure. No problem. Ahora van ustedes todos de nuevo. Bien ya. Ah, empieza, Mauricio. Okay. Hey, Jim, how are you prepared to protocol list for workers yet? What do you mean? Don't you remember that we are going to to visit a company tomorrow? Uh, that, I don't really know what to list. You must greet and be polite. You must keep your face mask on all the time, etc. Since now I have a better idea. I'll start working on that now. Great. Please show it to me when you are done with it, okay? Sure, no problem. Okay. Ahora con, este con Marixa. Marixa. Voy a silenciar el... Vamos, Marixa. Voy a hacer Jen, tú, Anne. Alexa. Ok. Tú eres Yo Anne. Yo soy Anne. Sí. Anne. When. Hey. Jim, have you prepared the protocol list for work, workers yet? What do you mean? <ríe> Permita. <ríe> Perdón. Don't you remember that we are going to visit a company tomorrow? Ah, uh, that. I don't really know what to list. You must greet, greet and be polite. You must keep your face mask, your face mask on all the time, etc. Thanks. Now I have a better idea. I'll start working on that now. Great. Please show it to me when you are done with it, okay? Sure, no problem.
We have 16 now. Let's see if the other people come up. Okay, they are out. <clears throat> okay. Only that, we are only 20. Okay, let's see. This is great. 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 So it's a, this is great. And this is great. Great, great. Great, great. Okay. Great, great. Great. Okay. Great. Hello. Right. Great. Hello. Okay. To cause a good impression, if you visit a company, what things can make you make a good impression? There is a, a former. Uh huh. Okay. What else? The correct desk, dress code. Okay. Uh huh. Use the correct dress code. Exactly. What else? So dress, dress accordingly, appropriately. Mm -hmm. What else? What else do you think we should do? Okay. I don't know how you say lenguaje corporal. Use appropriate body language. Mm -hmm. Okay, excellent. What else? Speak well, sure. Speak? Well, sure. Okay, you should speak well. Okay, uh -huh. yes. What else? Be organized and be concise and specific. Okay, and you will cause a good impression. Okay, etiquette at work. Etiquette at work. What are some things that are important to practice at your job? Be on time. Be on be time. Mm -hmm. Be polite, be on time. What else? Be respectful. Be respectful. Do things well. Be proactive. Vestiment. Sorry? Vestiment. Yes, the dress code. The dress code. Uh -huh. Dress correctly. Mm -hmm. Don't expect the boss to be telling you what to do. Be proactive and do what you know that you have to do. What else? Take a shower. <laughs> Hey, a shower before you go to work. Yes. Be punctual. Be punctual. Wear a don't, uniform. Uh -huh. Don't go out before time. Don't leave the, the office before time. Yes. What else? Don't eat. When no is the time. Don't. Uh -huh. Don't eat while working. Mm -hmm. Okay. Don't eat in the office. Yes. What else? Don't sleep in the office. Don't sleep in the office. Okay. Don't use the telephone to talk about the immortality of the crab. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Only use it to talk about things related to your job. Okay. Excellent. Very good. So, okay. We only had one that was about the COVID, but maybe you remember the rules about COVID. What were the rules about COVID? Do you remember? Use mask. Yes, wear a face mask. You can make. Wear mask. a face mask. 
Uh -huh. Use alcohol gel. What else? To matter of distance. Keep your distance. Keep your distance, two meters of distance. Uh -huh. What else? Wash the hands, the hands frequently. Wash your hands frequently, exactly. Wash your hands frequently. What else? Don't shake hands. Don't shake hands. Mm -hmm. Don't shake hands, okay. Excellent. If you, if you have COVID, COVID, stay at home. If you have the COVID, stay at home. Don't spread it. <laughs> Don't spread it around. Okay, excellent. Very good. Nice, very good. Now let's go to attendance. Abigail Mejia. Present. Excellent. Ana Maria Portillo. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Andrea Amalia Garcia. Okay. Andrea Maria Cruz. Dilcia Yamile Fernández. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Emma Gloria Martínez. Present, teacher. Excellent, very good. Esmeralda del Carmen Ayala. Present, teacher. Excellent, very good. Gabriela Beatriz Moreno. Present. Excellent, nice. Jorge Antonio Sánchez. Present, teacher. Excellent, very good. Jose Ezequiel Guzmán. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Juan Jose Herrera Alvarenga. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Kenya Elizabeth Rodriguez. Lady Xiomara Chicas. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Maritza Yanir Hernandez. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Maritza, you stay with me today. Okay. <laughs> bueno, teacher, está bien. Yes. Paola Stephanie Mejia. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Raquel Abigail Garcia. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Raquel Beatriz Segura. Okay, Rebeca Guadalupe Aguillón. Present. Excellent, nice. Sandra Patricia Ramos. Present teacher. Excellent, very good. Stephanie Michelle Oviedo. Okay, Mauricio Antonio Velasquez. Present teacher. Nice, very good. And Jonathan Alexis Alfaro. Present. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for attending tonight. I will be seeing you tomorrow if God allows it. Okay, so sleep well, do the homework, sleep well. I will see you tomorrow. Okay. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Bye. 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 Good night, everybody. Good night. Yes. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Okay. Maritza, buenas noches. Buenas noches, teacher. ¿Cómo puedo ayudarle? ¿En qué cosas necesita ayuda? Fíjese que casi que solo en la pronunciación, eh, en algunos diálogos, por lo menos el que nos puso el arco, ese sí me costó bastante, pero por lo demás, sí siento que no voy tan mal. Ok, veámoslo. Y está bien cansadita. Sí, un ratito, <ríe> un ratito y un sí. ratito, ya nos vamos. ¿so? No se preocupe. Ok. Ajá, vale, se lo voy a leer. Usted me dice cuáles necesita repetir más y... Vale, esas. Ya. No, era el, el otro, el más largo. Más largo. El que solo leímos uno. Veamos. No. Creo que... Ajá, sí, por ahí, más arriba. Más arriba. El, es que es el último, el último, el último, el último, casi. Ah, ok. Oh, ¿Estás segura que era diálogo? Era como... Un párrafo. Ajá, un párrafo. Ah, ok. 
Este. Sí, ese. Sí, de acuerdo. Bueno, veamos entonces. There are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office. If you are late because you had an emergency, that's okay. However, habitual latecomers are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guideline will be to call the concerned authority and report the reason why you are late. Etiquette is also important when you have to communicate with employees or clients in any part of the world. In those cases, it is necessary to have a good knowledge of the workplace email etiquette of other countries. Okay, here, what, what word? Eh, dijo que se pronuncia, permítame, appreciate. Appreciated. 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 Yeah. Appreciated. 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 Dormite mejor. Y anda mi esposo corriendo. Ok. Y este es la donde dice: If you know that you will be late, them a good etiquette. Sí. Guideline. 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 Guide. Will be to call the. Esa también no puedo. Concerned. Concerned authority. Concerned. Concerned authority. Or authority. Authority. Okay. Authority. Y casi no veo también porque se me han arruinado los lentes. <ríe> Ahí tengo un. Ahorita estoy mal. Pero ya se lo van a arreglar. Ya sí, sí, sí. En report. Ay, estoy fatal de la vista. Casi no veo. Entonces dice, en report, the reason why, why you are late. Etiquette is also important. 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 When you have the communicate. How to communicate. Uh, uh -huh. How to communicate with employee. Employees. Employees or clients? Clients. Clients. Client. Client. Clients in any part of the world. In any part of the world. Mm -hmm. in, do, in, those, in those cases. Those cases. It is, necessary it is necessary to have good knowledge. Knowledge. Knowledge of the workplace. Of the workplace email etiquette. etiquette of other, other countries. countries okay vaya solo esas esas palabras casi que las que usted pudo observar me, me costaron bastante por lo demás y siento que no no soy tan tan perdida tampoco okay Entonces la dejo para que descanse nos vemos okay. <ríe> bueno teacher muchas gracias hasta mañana good night well, good night adiós bye bye bye, bye, bye. Thank <laughs> you.